Hello Scorpios, this is your reading for April 2018. This is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter signs. You guys are new. Welcome. Please like, share, subscribe, comment. Thank you guys for coming to check me out. We're going to do a Celtic cross. Put the cars face down, guys, okay? Please show me love messages for Scorpio for the month of April 2019. Love messages for Scorpio. It's the energy that's around you guys. What's challenging you for the month? What's underlying here? Oh, okay. Then we have two cards for the recent past. Let's see the best possible outcome in this situation. What's coming in for you guys is coming up next. How you actually feel about the situation, what's going on currently. Let's see what the influence is here for the month. And let's see your hopes and fears. Hopes or fears. And the overall. All right, guys. So let's go ahead and dig into this and see what's going on for you guys for April. What's going on around you? It's Ace of Wands wanting to start over, feeling very um, enlightened surrounding something here. Okay. Um, definitely, there's there's some communication that you want to start. Okay. Something you want to communicate. I feel. Okay. What's challenging you here is death. I'm feeling this is, of course, this card just spun around, but I'm going to read it in the upright because I don't know how it came. But um, there's definitely an ending here in a situation. Something ended in the past. Maybe communication was broken. Okay. Um, a situation ended. And there's a need for uh, you guys to initiate some change. Okay. Initiate some change. Something needs to change is by way of communication, by way of um, starting over. Okay. Now, since these cards are already upright and flipped over, we're going to go ahead and take a look at those. These, this is what was going on in the past. We have the Seven of Swords here um, and the Four of Pentacles. I'm feeling that you know you guys love the situation here. Okay, you left a situation to uh, gain your your stability. Okay, you felt mentally unstable. I feel you felt like you just wanted to be by yourself in the past. Okay, I'm getting that a lot of you um, left for financial reasons as well. You felt like you needed to get on your feet. It's just something that you felt like was best for you. Okay. I'm also getting that, you know, a lot of you guys, I feel, have been holding on to a situation where you felt like either something was done wrong to you or felt like you did something wrong to someone else, okay? You've been holding on to it. I think the challenge is to let that go um, and start over, start anew, okay? Now, the underlying issue here is the fool starting over taking a leap of faith towards something, okay, stepping out on faith, letting something go, starting over, basically it's a bottom line here, okay, Aries energy here, Capricorn, Aquarius, um, of course you're here, Scorpio, could be another Scorpio like yourself, but I'm definitely getting there's a need to let go of something, okay, start fresh and new. Let's see how you are seeing the situation currently is a three of wands. I'm definitely getting that um, you guys are looking forward to something. And um, I'm, I'm guessing that um, this is someone. There's somebody that you guys are looking forward to communicating with. This is somebody that you feel like is attractive. You feel like this person is a go-getter. Um, this is also somebody I feel like you guys probably walked away from, or either they walked away from you. Definitely. Definitely. 
but now I feel you guys looking for happiness with this person. Um, I feel either you're looking for happiness with them or they're looking for happiness with you. Somebody's searching for the other one, whether you or the other person here. Um, strong Aries energy here. Okay. <clears throat> best possible outcome here is the four of wands look at that happiness this is what you want okay I'm feeling that a lot of you guys want to get back together with someone and you want to communicate that that you want to start over that you want to bridge the gap yeah you have your differences but um, this is wanting to come together with someone here Aries again there what's coming in for you guys is the seven of wands here okay and this is you obtaining um, your confidence and standing by it, your your victory, your success. Okay, you you know exactly what you want to do, and I feel you guys doing whatever you need to do to acquire that. And this is you guys. I feel letting bygones be bygones um, here. Okay, I feel like the storm is behind you. This is what's coming in for you. The storm is behind you. I feel that you guys have made up your mind about something and you are now wanting to communicate these changes to someone or somebody is wanting to communicate these changes um, to you guys. Now, what's influencing the situation for the month is a Knight of Cups. Definitely a lot of emotions in this situation. Um, I feel like there is somebody that you guys care very, very deeply for, and you want to express that. Okay? And I feel like it's overdue. I'm hearing overdue. Long time coming. You determined to do that. Okay? Your hopes or fears is a five of cups <laughs> that you will make an offer and this person will turn it down that you would tell this person how you feel and they will basically shoot it down that you will be hurt in this situation that you will expose yourself your vulnerability and um, that you will end up being hurt and having regrets surrounding um, even reaching out and communicating exactly how you feel to an individual. Now the overall outcome here is the Ace of Pentacles. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Either somebody is, is extending an offer to you or you extending an offer to them. But there is definitely um, the, uh, an opportunity here to have something, start something that is stable, that could lead to a long-term commitment, okay? That could lead to the Ten of Pentacles. This is the start of something. This is using your resources. This is using your magician energy to acquire what it is that, um, that you want in this situation. Either you or someone else here, but that offer is definitely on the table here, okay? For a new beginning. For a new beginning guys okay so we have Aries strong here we have Leo here um, we have Taurus Virgo Capricorn energy present and we have Aquarius energy here guys so that is what I have for you guys and I will be speaking with you soon